Hello, I'm going to do a very different type of video today. Um, <clears throat> this right here is a box that um, I received because I ordered my first item off Poshmark. I've never ordered anything from Poshmark. I sell on there, not as much as I'd like, but I'd like to sell more. But um, part of the process of selling on Poshmark, it is a very social kind of uh, network. Um, platform, whatever you want to call it, where you share your closet, you share people's items, and you share uh, an item that you sold, or you you bundle things, and you do all kinds of stuff, and you, I guess, get a little more engaged with uh, the buyers. And I was sharing an item, and this item was from another seller. And I saw this item, and I said, well, I'm going to buy it. And I made an offer to her, um, and she accepted, and this is what it is. Now, I have to make a disclaimer, because I want to be honest about this, this package. This is not the first time it's been opened. <clears throat> when it arrived, my youngest son, who is six at this time, he opened it. He saw it was a package, he knew it was for me, and he opened it. So, it has been repackaged by the six-year-old. He felt bad that he opened it. So I have, I only looked at the item. I didn't look at anything else. Um, I didn't go through the box. So he put it back together and now I'm opening it for the first time really. I only, I've seen the item online, but I've not seen the item and looked at it um, that I purchased. So here we go. I have my knife here and my son has seen me package things. So he does know a little bit about packaging. So. He'd probably take it as good as the person who sent it to me. But I've never purchased anything on Poshmark. This is a first for me. And um, it was an interesting experience. Um, you know, I'm here to sell stuff, not really to buy. And But this was something I had to get. Um, I am not flipping it. This is for me to keep. I'm trying to be very careful. He did a pretty good job of repackaging it. So this is where he, he probably didn't do a very good job because he probably ripped it apart. But there was um, lots of tissue paper in the box. Um, you've got great taste. There's a sticker on there. He did a pretty good job repackaging it. It did come a little bit nicer than this, I think. But I had to buy this, and part of it was because I'm a cat person. So I purchased this item right here. And um, this is a small um, print of a cat uh, looking up at a, a bee. And I had to buy it because it was something um, that I like, orange cats, and I thought it was cool. And wanted to purchase something. And... Um, here it is. This is what I purchased, my first item purchased off Poshmark. But, as you go through the box, I believe there was more stuff. So there's lots of packing material that I can reuse, and I do reuse packing material. There is, um, it was well packaged. I'll tell you that. This was well packaged. There was lots of packing material in there. But this that was in there. This item that I didn't order, was in the box and this surprised me because I don't send anything in the stuff that I sell. I don't send extra items. I don't put any notes anymore because if you sell media mail, you can't do it. It'll uh, be sent back to you. But she sent me, the seller, this uh, cat toy that I did not order. It was put in there by the seller, uh, this cat toy, which I thought was pretty cool. And um, I don't know if it has catnip in it or not, and I haven't um, read the package, but uh, very cool little toy for your kitty. Uh, it also says uh, a sweet thank you on the bag. And then there's also a couple things more in here. I mean, this is, this is stuff I didn't order. This is stuff that the buyer, the seller, put in there for the buyer. Um, there's a, a coupons for Chewy, which is funny. Um, and there's a, uh, some cat stickers and a journal. Now, this could be stuff that she had for free. Who knows? 
thought that this would go well with this item. Um, certainly we'll find a use for these. I'm not sure if I'll use the journal for uh, anything to do with cats, but um, I certainly might use it to put down information uh, for things I list and um, use it that way. But it is a notebook and um, pretty, pretty cool that was in there. And then there was a handwritten note. I mean, a lengthy one. I mean, this is, this is a long note. This is not printed on a piece of uh, printer paper. And um, here's what it says. It says, uh, Dear Darcy, I cannot thank you enough for not only visiting my closet, but for also liking and purchasing the very beautiful orange cat looking at the bumblebee. I can tell you're a cat lover as you have three cats pictured on your page, on my Poshmark page. I used to. Now I have a, <clears throat> a theme of uh, Mardi Gras, uh, three heads on there. I am also one. These beautiful um, creatures being so much, bring so much love and joy. You can tell a lot from the person that loved them back. The letter was a compliment to you. If you have any questions or comments, even here and concerned, please search out as I want your complete satisfaction. After all, I would love to do with you again in the future, purchase again for in the future. Wishing you very well. Her name was Bridget. Uh, sorry about that, I was trying to read her writing in the one spot. Pretty interesting. I know people do this, but this is handwritten. Handwritten. Um, very unusual for me to see that in a package. I, I, I package the item so that it gets to the destination safely. Nothing more. I don't put any invoices. I don't put any notes in there. I know a lot of people do. I don't do it because I guess if you say something in there or do something, it couldn't cause an issue. But um, I don't do that. This was cool. This was unexpected. Um, again, I purchased this. This is about um, 20 bucks, I think. I'll put the item up there on the, on the screen, too. Um, it's a small print, and I thought it was really cool, and so that's why I purchased it on Poshmark. Now, um, that's one of the things that I think maybe the sharing of items and going to people's pages you will find something that you didn't think you wanted or in some cases uh, needed um, and as you're sharing an item on Poshmark uh, you come across it and go well maybe I'll make an offer on that and that's what I did with this um, she actually had a couple of these and um, I uh, I think I liked it first and then I made a counter offer and um, this is when I purchased. So this was my first item purchased on uh, Poshmark. I've never purchased anything before and um, thought I would share this, my experience, which was very good. Um, I know that each seller is different, but I thought this would be an interesting uh, thing to show people. Um, again, this is my first time me opening it. My um, six-year-old opened it previously and did a pretty good job repackaging it. He felt bad because he knew I was going to uh, do a video on this. So thank you for watching my channel and please like and subscribe to Podunk Picker. I'm going to do some different things than other um, YouTubers probably. And um, if you like the content, please like and subscribe. Make some comments. Tell me about your experience if you purchased something on Poshmark. Um, for me, it was very good. Maybe you had a good experience. Maybe you had a bad experience. Put it in the comments. Thank you again for um, being a part of uh, Podunk Picker.